Just over 40% of people in Beltrami County spend more than 30% of their income on housing, classifying them housing burdened. This often leads to the inability to pay rent and could then mean that person or person's family becomes homeless. And as our Mary Keeler tells us, people gathered today to talk about what is being done in Bemidji to break that cycle. It's a problem I think that's all over the world and <clears throat> I just think that we need to approach it as best we can. Homelessness touches the young and the old in Beltrami County. Well, the thing about homelessness is that it really represents very complex set of situations. Executive Director of the Village of Hope, Sandy Henham, says it's her calling to help those who have experienced homelessness and their shelter here in Bemidji serves between 50 and 55 people each year. She says one reason this is such a problem here is the lack of affordable housing. 20% of the people in Beltrami County spend more than 50% of their income. <laughs> Housing. Some listeners were shocked to find out that just under 60% of children in the county live in poverty. That's twice the state average. I simply didn't realize that the percentage was so high. I didn't know there'd be that many children that was homeless in, in this Beltrami County. I thought it'd be more uh, like single adults. But there is a silver lining. In Bemidji, we have a group of professionals that are dedicated to working together. Meaning more shelters and transition programs have been on the rise in the area. I can't tell you how pleased I am with um, the new buildings that have opened. And community members left the presentation with a greater understanding of what is happening and a belief that they can help. I really uh, encourage uh, everyone uh, to take a look at this and see how they can contribute. I'm proud that Bemidji is doing as much as it is um, to alleviate the problem. With more people informed, there could be more hands on deck to combat this problem. In Bemidji, Mary Keeler, Lakeland News. The Village of Hope will host a fundraiser at Bemidji's Hampton Inn on June 8th to raise money for their programs. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.